I'm Liz Clayman with today's Clayman Confidential. With us now is Joe Cordero. Joe is of the Cordero Group, but he's also a former New Jersey law enforcement director. The Apple story, Apple versus the Department of Justice, is turning into a very cloudy question here. It is national security versus privacy. You're on the side of the national security part of it. That seems to be where many people are, and yet... We also have to worry about privacy. Imagine that we have Silicon Valley CEOs here. Convince them that they should open their encryption doors to law enforcement. Well, you just struck a very important nerve for a lot of people. And yet you have Apple saying, if we allow the Department of Justice or law enforcement authorities to hack into this phone that belonged to the San Bernardino shooter who murdered 14 people, then they will then turn around and take that software key and use it to open other people's phones that may have never approved it. Is that fear at all in the back of your mind? Well, it is um, to an extent. But look, um, you know, uh, we have a lot of smart people in this country. Apple is one of the most creative companies in the U.S. Um, clearly that I'm sure that working with the government, they can devise a method for being able to extract the information that government wants pursuant to a warrant, provide that information to law enforcement rather than a key to their encryption system. Wow. Uh, <laughs> Although then you get the precedent setting. It's so fascinating. Sure. And I know it matters to a lot of you. So you can watch it on LizClayman.com. And of course, watch Countdown to the Closing Bell every day, 3 p.m. Eastern on the Fox Business Network.